why is it that when we have to wake up early in the morning and have to be somewhere that day i tend to enjoy my sleep better than any other day <laughs> Alright, so Fondap we're going to Santa and Rivonia. I've never been there. Um, I hope I don't get lost. Alright, so we're at Hatfield and right now I'm just going to catch how train. Uh, yeah. Public transport sometimes can be pain because I I feel like I've been in that taxi for more than an hour, bro. Like it's yo, what's up? So today we're not doing TikTok, we're doing YouTube. I got this podcast invitation in Joburg, and yeah, I thought I should cover that in YouTube format. I hope you love this. <laughs> All right, so the reason I enjoy making TikTok vlogs is because I don't have much to say. Like even now, I'm still thinking like, what am I going to talk about? I want to talk like so that this YouTube format can be long as you guys request. So I don't know if it's proper to talk about this, but a lot of people say they want to be content creators, but I don't know. I feel like they, they just think this is an easy job. It's just take pictures post shoot the video post but it's not it's not all that man. I mean the internet is there it's all about watching tutorials reading books you know how to edit your pictures I mean at the end of the day if you want to be a content creator be a content creator that stands out don't don't want to be average and be like everyone who just takes selfies and just post them as well they are I don't know, I'm just saying, if you want your content to be rare or you want it to be different from others, then put in work, read books, watch tutorials on how to edit, uh, not only how to edit, like even tutorials on social platforms that you're posting on, like it, I think it's something you should get less about, you know, what time to post, when to post, which days to post. Okay, my shooting is more of point and shoot, but the editing skills, they definitely come from watching a lot of YouTube tutorials, uh, reading about, then there, I don't like reading. I enjoy watching instead of reading, you know, so they come from watching a lot of tutorials on YouTube. So I'm at Santan. Uh, I'm not hungry, but I feel like chewing something. So right now we're just going to catch a bus to to Rivonia. I'm not sure if it's going to drop me where I am heading. <laughs> that Croc Manoir Gautrain bus assisted me a lot. Uh, I didn't know this place, but he dropped me off and he showed me where to get the bus when I'm going back as well. So I'm at Rivonia. It looks looks like a fancy suburb. It's a it's a nice place. But what was I expecting? I mean, this is the neighborhood yes I'm seeing. My phone is on 20%, my data is on because I'm using Google Maps to find the location. I doubt if it will survive until I get back home, but, but I'm definitely shooting the podcast. So apparently I'm lost. Uh, this is not the direction I'm, I was supposed to take. Now I am heading back. I don't even remember how I came this side because I took so many turns and I'm only left with like 35 minutes for the interview to start and it's super hard <laughs> I don't know if I should try running maybe jogging 
Okay, let's try that. Let's try jogging a bit. I know a bit of uh, fluffy kind of sweat, I know, but hey, I just have to, just to be on time. Now I think I'm on 16% as well. Alright, so we are here and yeah, it was a stretch. So, this is it. Keep central. Oh, I don't know what time is it, but I think I still have 15 minutes to cool off. And then, yeah, so I think let's get in. I need water and I'm super pressed. I need to go to the loo. <laughs> Today, we're not alone. We're joined by a very special guest. Yeah, somebody that I initially stumbled upon Twitter. And that video was him basically showing us how he loves coffee. Then I was like, no man, come on, who's this? Went into TikTok and I saw the rest of his daily vlogs. Our guest today is none other than God Butler. What's your name, by the way, my brother? <laughs> uh, my real name is Ketabato, or Franz. We'll yeah. just pick and choose lapo. Yeah, please, please. <laughs> and we're all about getting to know you on a much more deeper and personal level. So sure. let's get into it. And firstly, we'd like we'd like to find out where are you from and like mm. originally, where did you grow up? Uh, that went well. Uh my third interview ever since this content creating thing so with the first two i was super nervous but with this one i was more relaxed i think i'm just you know getting used to it as as time goes so now i'm heading back to Santon. i'm just going to catch a taxi ah not a taxi a bus i'm sorry my mind is somewhere but anyways uh <laughs> this was nice uh currently check the podcast cliff central uh the third draft i'll definitely talk about it on tiktok as soon as i have the link and i'll share with you guys so yeah it was it was really nice i was relaxed it was like having conversations with you know with my homeboy with my friends instead of you know me thinking a lot and being in, in a panic mode Alright, uh, right now I'm in Santon, I feel kind of hungry, so I thought I should grab something to eat and then head straight back home. Uh, I'm on 4% and I think you probably know what I'm going to eat. And I just met one of the biggest TikToker. Oh, I also want to follow. What's up? You also want to follow? Don in coma. Funny. D O W N N I E N K H O M A. Alright, so where, where can people follow you? TikTok. On TikTok. 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 Where are you at? Alright, so right now I'm on 1%, and that's Donny. Uh, kindly go and follow. <laughs> 